how to install applications on Mac. If you're using MacBook Air, MacBook Pro, iMac or Mac Mini, the steps are going to be same. Now, for installing any particular application, the basic thing we do is we visit App Store and we search for that particular app. And once we get that app, we just select that and we select get option and the application will be downloaded and installed automatically. But not all the applications we want are present on App Store. So let's say if I want to search for Zoom video call application, if I search for it, you can see the original Zoom video call app is not present on App Store. So how can we download Zoom app? Or else, let's say if you want to search for Google Chrome, you can see even Google Chrome is not present on App Store. In such cases, how can you download these apps from website and how can you install it? So I'm going to guide you through that process. So you can go and visit Safari. You can find that in Dog, or else you can go in Launchpad and you can search for Safari. Now, once you open Safari browser, you can visit Google and over there you can search for application whichever you want. So let's say if I want to download Zoom video call app. So this is the uh, page. It will give you multiple website. You can go on zoom.us, you can search that particular option. So you can search for that particular website. Now, once you visit that website, uh, if you are on Zoom, you can go down and you can select download option over here and it will give you downloading option. But if you're using Mac, you can, you know, select this option over here. You can tap on here and then you can see download downloading has started. So this was for Zoom application. Once the download is complete, all you can do is you can go in finder, you can go in downloads here, you can find that installation setup. Now, let's say if I want to download Google Chrome, once again, I'm on Google now, we are going to search for Google Chrome and it will give you downloading options. So you can select Google Chrome browser and then you can directly get download Chrome option. So select that option and the downloading will be started. Now once the download is complete, you can select this download option. You can check out the file over here or else again, you can go in uh, finder and in downloads, you can check out for that setup file. Now we have two setup files, both have different installation process. So we are going to take a look at it. So let's say if I want to install Google Chrome for now. So I'm going to double tap this setup file, which we have just downloaded from web. After double tapping on that, you will get a pop up screen like this. You will get another finder window and in this process, if you want to install Google Chrome, you need to click and hold this icon and you need to drag it in this application folder. So click and hold it and drag it like this and just leave it. Now you can see it is installing Google Chrome. Now, once you install Google Chrome, you can check that application. You can go in Finder, uh, sorry, you can go in Launchpad and over here, you can see Google Chrome has installed. If I show you the next page, you can see Zoom application is not there on my Mac. In order to install Zoom application, again, I'm going to double click on this setup file. So this is the Zoom video call installation setup file. Double tap on that. And this time the window is slightly different. So again, you can just simply select continue option over here. If it is asking you for some permission, you can provide it again, continue. If you want to change the installation location, you can change that from here. Again, click install and then enter your MacBook password, which you use to unlock it. Once you enter the password, select install software. So now you can see it is validating the files and it is installing the application. Now, once the installation is done, you will get this confirmation message. You can simply select close option for now. And it is asking that the installation setup file, you want to keep it or you want to move it to bin so that the choice is yours. If you want to keep it, you can select keep. If you want to move it to bin, you can do that. So now you can see Zoom application has started automatically. And that's it. This is how you can download software or applications from website and you can install it. Now, one more thing uh, before ending this video, make sure whichever software or application you're downloading from website is from the trusted website. Don't try to download any software which is not from a trusted browser or not from a trusted website it may cause harm to your Mac. So always keep that thing in mind. So yeah, that's it for today's video, guys. If you find this video informative, don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you all in the next one. Thank you.